Hello guys, I am Mominul Islam and welcome to Diploma School. Today we are going to make some posit by using IR sensor. For making this uh, uh, posit uh, we need a uh, uh, professional. Here is a uh, for simulation purpose we are going to use this Proteus uh, 8. Uh, for on the programming we need another software uh, that is Arduino. We are going to uh, use this software for programming. We need uh, some library uh, for Proteus. Uh, that is Arduino library for Proteus and uh, we need also the infrared, uh, infrared sensor. So let's uh, open Proteus 8 uh, professional first. And after that, uh, this is workplace. And uh, from here, for component mode, actually, uh, we are searching uh, for our IR sensor, but uh, it is not showing here because it is not here. So, and what's about the Arduino? Uh, I am also searching Arduino, and see here is no Arduino Uno. Okay. So what we can do now? We we have to. Uh, we have to add uh, these two library in our Proteus for uh, so uh, I'm going to add these two library so this is infrared sensor library and uh, there is the Arduino library and so I need uh, this two file let copy control C and uh, after that uh, let's control v here all the file now together now i have to copy all the file okay and now i have to go in c drive here is the c drive uh, here is the program data this is the hidden file if you don't find it in your computer then go to view and just uh, mark it the hidden files then it will show so uh, now i am going to click the program data after that I have to click the left center electronics what it is yeah that is a left center electronics after that I have to go the library uh, sorry a library and after that I control V I'm pasting this software here so uh, I am now I am going to reopen the Fortia uh, eight. here is my Fortia eight. Now I am going to search the again the IR sensor. So here is the IR sensor. I am going to double click it, and here it is. Uh, here is the uh, our desired IR sensor. So you can move it here. So no problem. So how many pin in here? So see there is three terminal actually. Uh, VCC ground and out, and there is other terminal. This there is a test pin. So I am going to uh, give the power of IR sensor. So you can rotate this also. This is a five volt. Uh, this is the uh, this power means actually it is a supply five volt. So I am going to connect uh, with this uh, in VCC. That means it is going to give supply uh, in my IR sensor five volt. And this is ground. So I am going to uh, connect a ground on there. Yeah. Now I here is the output and here is the test pin. So as a test pin, I need a logic toggle. So I am going to search now a logic toggle. So active here is the uh, logic toggle. I am just double click it and I am just going to connect it with this in the test pin. So I am just uh, connected with this uh, test pin with this logic toggle. And in output, what is happening uh, in our output? So for that, I am connected the DC voltmeter with, with uh, this IR sensor output, and I am going to connect this in ground. After that, I need to uh, run the simulation. And before this, I need the program file of the IR sensor that is actually a hex file, and that is available in the uh, library folder. 
so this is infrared sensor for his file without this file this IR sensor is not going to work so before uh, run the simulation you have to add this uh, hex file on your infrared sensor so see uh, when it is uh, I am when it is 0 then uh, it is showing the 0 volt when it is 1 it in this output we got a uh, 5 volt so what does it mean actually that mean when an obstacle is detected by this IR sensor in this output it is uh, it give a uh, 5 volt if it is a uh, in uh, in the IR sensor output is uh, is nothing on there it is uh, it is uh, showing 0 volt and when it is 1 suppose a book uh, is detected by this IR sensor it is going to show 5 volt and when uh, there is nothing on there so it is uh, showing the zero volt. So uh, in this uh, in this way, this IR sensor actually detected any obstacle. So now I am going to connect the Arduino. Arduino, what is it? Here is the Arduino Uno. The double click it and click. On. Okay. Now I am going to mm, by this Arduino we can program anything so here is the Arduino and we need to program this Arduino so for programming Arduino we need the Arduino uh, so Arduino program uh, in for uh, in voice array we have to define which the best pin is going to be input or which pin is going to be output so this is the syntax of our written uh, pin mode uh, 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 in pin mode uh, you, uh, at, at first you have to write the pin mode and uh, after that uh, you have to define uh, which pin is going to be input or output he has 13 pieces output and uh, pin number 3 is uh, going to be input of my uh, of my project so in void loop we have to set uh, what uh, the program have to do uh, i have written the digital lead 3 is equal to equal, equal to low that means if uh, the infrared sensor output is low that time the pin number 13 will be high if i use a led in pin number 13 that uh, this uh, then if the uh, uh, pin number 3 uh, is low that's uh, then uh, the pin number 13 uh, or led will be high uh, if it is not uh, or pin number 3 is high then uh, then the led is going to be off so this is the basic program and here i have also used the delay uh, delay 10 uh, here 10 that means that it will be delay 10 millisecond and here for serial begin i have used for uh, actually uh, this tell the Arduino to get the ready to extend the message with the serial monitor at the rate of 96 bits per second. Yeah, now I am going to. Uh, these are the syntax actually. You have uh, how you can write the digital write and and uh, you have to know the syntax basically. So now I am going to uh, compile and uh, for generating a hex file, uh, you have to go to the preference. After that, you have to uh, click the. Uh, compilation see here the it is uh, compilation is a uh, uh, mark uh, if it is not a uh, uh, mark then uh, you uh, you uh, you will not going to get an hex file and now I am run the compilation uh, it is going on and uh, here you can see uh, yeah uh, this is a uh, completed done compilation so I am I am just going to uh, copy this uh, hex file location by pressing Ctrl C, okay. I am pressing Ctrl C for copying this uh, location and double click the uh, Arduino. Double click the Arduino and here the program file. I am going to uh, paste it and give it okay. And as we know, this input sensor output uh, is going to be uh, as the input of Arduino in pin number 3. So I am going to connect it with uh, pin number 3. This is the input of Arduino, and in pin number thirteen, I am going to connect a LED. So I am going to search it uh, in LED in component mode. This is the LED blue. I am going to take it. So here is the LED blue, and I am going to connect it in pin number thirteen. You can press minus uh, to the rotate uh, the LED or any component. Now I'm going to connect to a uh, ground pin on the LED. So here is the ground pin. Now I'm going to connect this uh, LED, uh, ground pin with this LED. 
uh, run the simulation now we can see uh, uh, if the uh, input sensor output in, you see input sensor output is zero I, uh, we don't give any uh, signal in the IR sensor so it uh, LED is on when it is going to be on uh, this time LED off thank you for uh, watching this video we are going to uh, make some uh, several videos related with IR sensor you will be invited to see this video thank you